All right, all right, all right. What's up, guys? Average Gamer signing on back with another video. Another week, another VGC challenge. We did the starter types these past three weeks. Now it's time to move on to everything else. And, you know, I mean, kind of have to start with normal, in my opinion. <laughs> I mean, where else are we going to start? So we have a monotype. We have a monotype normal team here. This is going to be interesting. I don't really like normal types that much because they're normal types. <laughs> But we're going to see how this goes. As always, I build a team I liked. Y'all know the drill. Six Pokemon, all normal types, three of which must have a normal type Terra. All right, before we get into it, be sure to like and subscribe. We're on our way to 300 subs. We'd love for you guys to be a part of that journey. The support the past two weeks have been crazy. Thank you guys a lot. All right, uh, going to the team. Tropicos is the only restricted normal type, so <laughs> that's what we're using, all right? Choice spec set, very basic. Thunderbolt, Earth Power, Ice Beam, and Terra Star Storm. It comes in, it does damage. Terra Shell makes it pretty hard to kill, so yeah. Next up, Arbolivia, one of my favorites from Gen 9, period, in terms of all Pokemon. Protect, Leech Sheet, Giga Drain, and Terra Blast with Harvest Citrus Berry. It will be very good against Sun Teams. And yeah, we just max this thing's bulk out. Pretty solid answer to any Kyogres that do not have Ice Beam. But if they do, I have Arbolivia, Water Terra. Hopefully they don't have Thunderbolt too. <laughs> most most only choose one unless they're like choice or whatever. Next up, Porygon 2. This is actually Neil, if I remember correctly, Neil Dumlop's set. Um, very genius set, I might ask. Shout out to him. But download Evil Light with Terra Blast, Shadow Ball Recover, and Trick Room. This is actually like gonna be the first time I think I'm running Trick Room. Maybe the second. But yeah, this thing comes in. It's bulky. It takes hits. And it kills stuff after Trick Room. <laughs> because download is pretty cool. And I have Dark Terra only because if I like am desperate and I need to not get taunted in order to win, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to Terra Dark, take the Prankster Taunt from a Tauren or a Whim, and go from there. Next up, Indeedee. Uh, normal Terra is not optimal, but I needed a Normal Terra to make this work. So we have Normal Terra on this with Hyper Boys, Helping Hand, Trick Room, and Follow Me with the Psychic Surge combined with the Psychic Seed. Yeah, thing like Porygon 2 comes in, redirects damage, takes hits, sets up Trick Room, supports the squad, you know? <laughs> Next up, Ursaluna. First time I'm ever using this, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> um, I've been looking for an excuse to use this thing, but yeah, I just never did. Very basic Life Orb set, Blood Moon, Earth Power, Hyper Voice Protect, you've seen the set everywhere, got Normal Terra on this as well. And lastly, we gotta go with one of the favorites, that's one of the rules. Focus Sass, Technician, Normal Terra, Fake Out, Ambipom. I love this Pokemon so much. <laughs> this thing does so much damage. I was actually thinking about putting Normal Gym on this, but I was like, I decided against it. Just so I have Staying Power. And Acrobatics once I lose my Sass, with Triple Axle as well. And then obviously you gotta have protect. Okay. Squad set. I'm very interested to see how this one works. This is the first time I'm running like a hard trick room team. I'm pretty sure I used trick room before, but it wasn't like a win condition really. It was like something I could do to get rid of my opponent's trick room, not really use it for myself. So we're gonna see how this works. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into the battles, man. All right, first game. Shout out to me, by the way. We made these intros shorter, baby. Didn't really explain the sets though, but all you have to know, max speed on max attack on Ambipom and Tropagos. Full bulk on this and this. I just made sure I could survive a close combat from Urshifu on Ursaluna. And then like Neil's set. So yeah. <laughs> Very simple. Uh, pretty standard Glass Fear team we're facing though. The Incineroar Rillaboom Urshifu is such a, such a great combo, man. Um, how do I want to do this? I could do that. Doing that could be good. Hmm. Uh, I'm, okay, I like those two first, I think. I think I like those two first. Got the fastest fake out. Thunderbolt Rex, two of his mons. 
Terra Storm hits all of his mons. Probably, I could just Stellar Terra immediately, honestly. I'm probably the fastest on the court. Oh god, I'm out of time. Shoot. Uh, <laughs> we'll just do that. <laughs> Jesus. Oh wait, I think he ran out of time too. He wasn't ready either. Okay, if it's in Cinder or Rillaboom lead, we know what we know. If it's in Cinder or Rillaboom lead, we know what he's gonna do. It is. Okay. So we know what to expect. It's Urshifu Glacier in the back. Urshifu's most likely Scarfed. Well, not Glacier, but uh, Calyrex Ice. It's raining outside. Y'all can't see that, obviously. Huh. Raining and playing Pokemon. What a lovely thing. Uh, what are you bringing in here? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I don't feel like risking that. Okay. This is fine, everything's fine. <clears throat> That's the only reason I don't want to risk that. Oh, I'm actually faster than his Incineroar. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Um Yeah, I think it's time we blow stuff up. In a pretty good spot, if I do say so myself. Let's follow me. And let's go crazy. I could have maintained my terror shell, but I think it's fine. Because this way, I should kill both here. This way I can bring in my Ursuluna. His Willow Moon can only take out one. He probably does it against my, uh, what's it called? Oh, I actually don't kill him anymore. That bulky freaking boy. Um. Regardless, I bring in Ursuluna here. Knocked off kind of sucks, but it doesn't matter. I bring in this now. Um, how do I want to play this? We know he has glass here in the back. Well, Calyrex Ice, excuse me. He may w just waste his fig out here. He could just go for Woodhammer, though, immediately, which would be bad. Um, he could fake out my Chiropagos. 
and try to kill with like a flare bliss or something if he has it. <sighs> Protecting Marceloon is a risk because I could this turn could be nothing more than damage on a Tarapa Ghost, and I think there in that situation I think I just lose. Okay, that's fine. No matter what, I want damage on this. Oh, he just knocks off. Okay, this is fine. My life work gets gone, but that's okay. Because from this range, I don't think I died to a Grassy Glide. I'm trying to get to a situation where I'm 2v1ing the Calyrex. Okay. So now we Hyper Voice. And Terra Starstorm. And the next turn we Terra Starstorm Blood Moon. Hopefully that KOs the uh, Calyrex Ice. Hopefully. Hopefully. We live. That freaking Incineroar lived. I hate that fat cat. Oh, I hate that thing. This is now bad. I hate that thing so much. Now he resets fake out. What a bummer. Ugh. I hate Incineroar. I hate him so much. Okay, what does he fake out here? Well, he obviously fakes out Tarapagos, but... Now I know why Covert Cloak on Tor- uh, and his thing is actually faster than me. Huh, okay. So he doesn't have a slow Calyrex. <laughs> Cause my uh, Ursula Blood Moon is actually not like, pure low speed. I think it has like 15 IVs. Maybe. Uh, bummer first game. Uh, what can I have done better? Not killing that Incineroar kind of lost it for me. Cat's too fat, man. It's gonna do nothing. Yeah, look at the damage on that Calyrex. Ugh, hate that cat. I should have killed it quicker, I guess. Uh, the Ambipom didn't do a ton, right? That's kind of the main thing. Ambipom didn't do a lot. Um... That switch turn one for him was pretty good. Yeah, probably faking out the Incineroar first. Losing my NDD that quickly probably wasn't the greatest. But, cool first game, cool first game. Alright, bounce back game against the boy Kevin11. Oh my god, an Entei? I haven't seen that in forever. Entei Chin Pal at that. Okay. Uh, what do I lead here? He can lead Tornogre against me pretty well. Um... <laughs> Tornover actually would be pretty lit against me, not gonna lie. I could do that. I could do that. Didn't bring Rillaboom in. Uh, what's that sound? <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, I'm fine with that. Bring Tarapagos in the back. Don't know if he has Ice Beam or Thunder, but we're gonna see. Honestly, I think I live in Ice Beam, to be honest. Um, last Mon. Chin Pal probably has Sacred Sword. I don't really want to bring Porygon to. Bring Ursaluna, I guess. 
Genshur or Close Combat live Blood Moon after, potentially. But we'll set up Trick Room in this game. Alright, let's go, Kev. Okay. Makes sense. Can't taunt me here, which is wonderful. Let's see if we can get this off. His play here would be like water spouting and uh, bleak wind storming, trying to kill my what's it called? Ooh, he switches out. Okay, that's fine. So we enter a trick room up here, which is great. Speed drops cool. Uh, it's raining in the game and raining outside my window. Alrighty. Uh, how do I want to play this? Leech seeding this torn, I'm not really like caring about that much to be honest. Oh, I could switch out here. My Ursa Luna, I could. I don't think I want to, though. Yeah, mm, mm, I kind of want to. The fact that he didn't switch out makes me think he doesn't have freaking Ice Beam. I'll commit. I want to save this Arbor Olivia for that freaking, uh, what's it called? I do want to save it, so... Oh my god. Um, okay. I don't know why he did this, to be honest. I'm about to kill this Rilla, though. Eh, he does have Grassy Glide, though. Uh, probably don't live it, to be honest. If I Terra, I probably live it. To be... Uh, well, uh, what item would it have? Maybe Miracle Seed. If it's Miracle Seed, I probably don't live. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Um, we're bringing DD back in. Yep. Arbolivia should live one bleak wind. Yeah. Sucks I have to eat that. I could have brought in Tropagos, but it's whatever. Now the real question is, do I just tear a Hyper Voice right now? I have two turns of Trick Room. If I do that... Do I think that Kyogre's choice is kind of the question on whether I do that? Because saving Terra Shell could be valuable to survive that Kyogre long term. I could also in ring when I want to if I did Terra with my Tropagos. I'm gonna play safe first. I don't want to commit my Terra yet. Although I do think I could kill both of them right now with a Terra Hyper Voice, I might not want to.
Uh, what's this? Oh, Kyber again. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Hyper Voice? Honestly, this is helping hand Hyper Voice, right? I don't think we need to do anything. Uh, I don't know why I'm talking so freaking softly. <laughs> yep, this is helping. He's gonna blizzard me. Are you kidding? Is this a thing now? I remember facing some mess like this like last week. Is this a, actually a thing now? Do I just get blizzard all day now? I'm glad I saved my Terra, so I'm gonna water Terra my Arv Olivia now. Guaranteed. Guaranteed gonna water Terra my Arv Olivia. Glad I saved my Terra. I've seen this floating around, dude, like... I've seen that mess floating around. I don't know what that is. Who's that? Entei, fine. Um... Yeah, our Bolivia is sick here. Seen that so much, and I do not understand it. I do not understand it. <clears throat> Double weather torn. It's pretty tight to be honest. Pretty tight. Can't even be mad at it. I respect it. I did a weather video like a month back, so hey. Maybe two months at this point. So I respect the multiple weathers. On the fastest on the court. Very nice. As long as I don't freeze, we're good. I'm very shocked he broke that, by the way. Alright. Saving our Terra was a great play. And we harvested our berry, because we're nice like that. We harvested our berry, because we're nice like that. Alright. This game's over. Should be, at least. Very nice. Very nice. Normal team. We. St oh, yeah. He didn't Terra yet. <laughs> Probably going to Grass Terra, his uh, Entei. And it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, well, I guess he could make a play here. Protect his Kyogre. But I don't think his Kyogre has Protect, so. <laughs> like I said, I don't think it has Protect, so. We win anyway. See, so he doesn't have a means of killing my, uh... Oh, crap. <laughs> Never mind, that's bad. It's actually not good. But it doesn't really matter. Well, I am locked into Urkar, but he's half health, so it should be alright. I did nothing, by the way. Uh, I, brr, I might lose, to be honest. <laughs> I might lose, to be honest. I might lose. Oh my god, I lost. That's crazy. Crazy. Should have Terra Star Stormed. That's tough. <laughs> That's tough. I forgot he still had Terra. I completely forgot he had Terra still. Everything's okay. Everything's okay. The fact that he has Trailblaze is so annoying. The one move that got him out of this. So annoying. Ugh, so stupid. So stupid. Alright, we're fine. It's fine. I forgot he had Terra. Completely forgot he had Terra. Honestly, I thought he used it on the Kyogre. Max Blizzards, to be honest. But that's okay. That's okay. 
All right, next game. I swear, man. Uh, Trailblaze was the one thing that got out of him. Because although, I think two Earth Powers probably would have killed. <clears throat> but Trailblaze not only gave him stab, made him faster than me. Crazy work, crazy work. Anyway. Uh, whoa, we got a Calyrex team. Calyrex Shadow, at least. And yeah, normal types work great. <laughs> um... I'm seeing more and more Sableyes pop around as well. To be honest, I'm not. F I have not fought a Flutter main that often in this format. My guess would be Final Gambit Annihilate. Um, how do I want to handle this? I don't know how I want to deal with this. See, Final Gambit's me. He can go NDD Kali, Smeargle Kali, uh, stop fake out, probably go NDD Annihilate as well. I actually have no idea how I want to do this. <laughs> I have no clue. Alright, we'll bring Porygon. We'll do that. <laughs> Because my brain is thinking way too slowly. Basic trainer cards. Shout out. Shout out. Ooh. It's thundering now. That's just wonderful. Okay, Smeargle and this. That's fine. Ooh, I could. This miracle is probably gonna fake out if it doesn't have like white guard or something. So what I could do? I could. I feel like switching in is probably the play. But do I switch out my Porygon or switch out my? Tarapagos. Let's switch out my Tarapagos. I wasn't paying attention, so I don't know if he had booster energy proc or not. Nor did I know if I uh, what my download was. Because <laughs> I don't pay attention to anything. Because I'm freaking dumb. Uh, but I would imagine Shadow Ball would do decent damage. He doesn't fake out. He'll probably just spore something automatically. Please spore that. Okay, yeah. I'm fine with you sporing that slot. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, speed boosting. That's fine. Yeah, it's going to be a very slow start here. That poor gun. Poor gun looks so clean. Good. Uh, if it's not... I didn't see boost energy. He might be specs. That's solid damage. He'll spore me, which, like, I'm fine with that. Probably Calyrex here. Or Annihilate. Alright, Calyrex. Ooh, wonderful. It's 
he spores me again, I'm gonna be so upset. Okay, that's what you're gonna do. An interesting decision, to say the least. And break Sash on this. Ah, very uneventful, very uneventful. I don't know why he decorated me. <laughs> he pro I think he misclicked. I think he misclicked. Oh, wonderful wake up. It's gonna be solid damage here. Wonderful. All right. Probably draining kiss from him. Oh, just spamming force. Okay, that's fine. Both of us die here. Oh, indeed, he actually lived. Look at us, going crazy. All right. Uh, main issue <clears throat> is oh, it's life orb. Never mind. My issue is gone. <laughs> Never mind, we're good. Everything's good now. About to say, I was gonna be kind of nervous because I again have a spread move that can hit both uh, Smeargle and Calais, but Smeargle died, so now I can hyper voice with no worries. Oh, uh, this is the last term of Trick Room, right? Yes, it is. Just spin this uh, guaranteed sleep turn. Temp? Ooh, he did not die. Alright. Okay, this is fine. Everything's cool. Uh, doesn't know what. The last Pokemon's most likely Annihilate. Most likely. Yeah. Okay, this is fine. Okay, I'm gonna preserve Terror Shell first. So I'm not going to attack. I'm not gonna Terrasalize yet. Sucks I can't use Terra Starstorm though. But Did he Terra yet? He didn't. What would the Terra option be? War Terra is not a terrible. I'm gonna do that. Okay, it was Final Gambit. Okay. Bummer. Gotta live this. Don't know if I can, though. Ah. Uh. Playing terrible. Maybe like one or two mistakes are kind of killing me. I don't even know. Yeah, I mean the sleep. Now nah, I kind of just ran out of trick room. That's kind of the only issue. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Facing some very really weird matchups. Very weird matchups. But I'm actually liking the squad. I'm making like one mistake in losing, which I'm okay with. All right, last one. Let's see if we can get a dub. Because this is going to be the last one. A, I'm tired. B, <laughs> it took me so... I'm tired. B, wait. Yeah. B, <laughs> I, I'm tired because it takes forever to get games. Obviously, it's edited for you guys. For your viewing pleasure. 
But I have another Calyrex team here. It's actually really unfortunate. I would have probably won that last game if I tear up my Tropicos, because at 165 base, I probably live a final gambit, to be honest. But I didn't think he would go for it, because, like, there's, like, no need. Like, why are you just killing yourself? But, like, you know. <laughs> but Flare Man probably would have killed me anyway, so probably all right. All right, let's see if we can get one dub here. Um... I th I'm confident about those three. Who do I bring last? Who do I bring last? I got it better at not going to time every <laughs> every freaking match. Um, we'll bring Ambi Palm. We'll bring the favorite. We'll bring the favorite. Oh, that's a dope trainer card. Alright. <clears throat> this is fine. Okay. I think my play here is to do this. I think. I don't need Trick Room, at least not right now. Faster than Ursaluna. Well, I should be. So I'm gonna do that. At the very least, I can get rid of the other main here. Y'all can't see, it is so dark in my room right now, because it's raining. So dark in my room. And I tend not to play with light. Oh, this is fine. This is perfectly fine. You double protecting? Oh, obviously not, because Flutterman would have protected first. And there's no booster on that Flutter, I don't think, so. Uh, what would this Flutter go for? Icy Wind, maybe? Wait, am I stupid? Did the Flutter Main attack? I looked down for like two seconds. <laughs> what did the Flutter Main do? Am I at full health on both my mons? I did not check at all. What What is that nickname? Uh, what what that flutter main do? <laughs> I'm at full. What the flutter main do? Am I? He either did, maybe the flutter main set trick room. You know what? You know what? That's probably what he did. He might have set trick room either for his own or saloon or to reverse my own. That's probably what he did. Probably bait Terra out of this, which is good because I can fake it out later. Oh, he just protects. Wonderful. I'll take that. I'll take that. Th I now can trick room. And I win. If I kill a social room at least. Plus one Terra Blast? Yes, sir. Alright, we'll trick room and win now. Wonderful, we end off with a win. Well, ho okay, I said that like the second game and I lost. Let me actually, let me actually see if I do win first. Okay, that's to be expected.
pretty surprised he did not Terra there. I don't even think I need to Trick Room, but we'll play it safe. Oh, they don't die in one hit, I don't think. Oh, yay! We did it! <laughs> Honestly, with that one win, this is one of the more successful challenges we've had these past four weeks. Alright, GG to my man, GG to everyone. Solid game, solid video if I do say so myself. Uh, yeah, I don't like this type. <laughs> I do not like the type. Feels underpowered to me. A lot of trick room oriented stuff though. But there are, like, some pretty cool techs with normal types, right? Like, I didn't use it, but Grafai is slacking. All that Snorlax stuff. So many good, there are good normal types to be fair. They're just not the way I like to play. So although they might be good, they're not my play style personally. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's starting to pick up the rain, so I gotta end. Okay, like and subscribe if you enjoyed. On our way to 300 subs. Thank you guys so much for the love. Thanks for watching. Irish Gamer signing out. Catch you next time.